Now, getting through the golf ball is as simple as just doing this. So, as you can see here, I am really having a nice rotation through the golf ball, but look, if we go straight back to setup, look at my front foot from that front on angle there. It's got that slight flare to it. So this is what a lot of you miss out massively, is if you don't flare out that foot, you have no chance of turning into your hip capsule. Because if that front foot is dead straight, like vast majority of all of you do, you now can't turn all that much into your hip socket. Just look at this. I mean, I'm gonna turn as much as I can into my hip socket here in my rotation, let's like say an impact with this foot dead straight. That's as much as I can rotate. So that's about what a lot of you look. You get a little bit open, but it's quite a small amount. So now, if I flare out that front foot, just like that, I'm gonna be able to have a lot more range of motion of my hips. I'm going as much as I can until my range of motion stops me. That's a lot of rotation. So you can imagine if you're going through the golf ball and you have that front foot a little bit flared, you're gonna have an uninhibited turn through the golf ball. You're not gonna have that feeling like you're hitting a brick wall as you're getting through the golf ball, like you would do with having a dead straight front foot with a toe pointing in front, you will hit a brick wall in your rotation. Let's get to a drill that's gonna help us get through that golf ball alongside with that. So my favorite drill to do alongside this to really get you clear and get you getting through that golf ball is called the preset rotation drill. So I set up like this, rotated impact. You can see my hips are as open as much as I can, chest is open as much as I can, and we can see my right shoulder has dropped down to my right hip, the right side bend, and we see my weight is also here, 90% on that left side. So then I just swing up and swing through. My body has this tremendous amount of rotation that happens just from springing back through the golf shop. So again, another one, have that front foot flared, because if you're not from flaring out that front foot and you try to do this preset impact, you're not gonna get that rotated at the preset. So here we go, again, flare out that front foot as much as you can, then spring back, spring through, doing the preset rotation drill, absolutely perfect. So really stray away and shy away from doing something just from aesthetics. I don't think that looks too bad, to be honest. The golf shots that get created from it are much, much better. So if you're struggling to get through the ball, don't fall on the first hurdle, because this generally is it. If I see a student sending a swing and they're saying in the comments section, I really can't turn through the golf ball, and I see this, you know, you haven't even tried, really. You've got to get that front foot flared out. So. If you enjoyed this video, of course, click that like button. If you want more golf instruction just like this, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell button too to be notified every time I put out a video. So let's flare that front foot and then we'll get ourselves getting and clearing through impact way better.